So, well, I'm 100. How was it, Paul? It was pretty fun. Better than we expected. Can you uh, maybe tell us what happened to uh, our bike? I think after Taylor wrecked it, <laughs> I don't think it's too bad. I think it's just the... Oh, no, there's more than the... He broke the tank. I'll kill you, Paul. That... <laughs> That tank that I uh, spent all that time on <laughs> pulled it off of uh, another mini bike up on the rack up there. The inside, all I had to do was put a couple nuts with some gas in, shake it out, dump it out, and use it. There was hardly any rust. It was really clean. Not so clean anymore. Mm, apparently not. <laughs> and we tested the hell out of this bike. How would it feel though? Oh, dude, it's really sweet. We did swing arm which makes it full suspension it just works perfect so going around corners it just it's set up kind of like a pit bike it just digs the state a stage two tillotson um, with the Makuni carb tilt mount plate fast torque converter because of that juggernaut and you can get a really smooth drift around corners if you're flat tracking because of this added wheelbase especially if you scoot way up on the seat and get your weight you know kind of on the front end then it slides really well oh another thing we were testing on this race we were using these billet risers um, and they worked out beautifully they held up to that wreck the only thing that bent on the wreck was the uh trees so speaking of the wreck the... so okay we got we got we left early for the line for oklahoma your truck looks good with this uh these clouds in the back Watched it yesterday too. Did you just <laughs> just for the video? Just for the video. Ready? Yep. We got there, got to hang out for a little bit, ride around, meet some people. Quite a few people here. Yeah. Cars lined up. And then they started the car racing, which was really cool. But we got to watch the cars go around, and they were doing the same track we were. So they got some of the dust off. I love this setup. Well, you look like a substitute Mandalorian. A substitute <laughs> Mandalorian. <laughs> like a uh, cheap version? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like the one you get off of Wish. It takes four months to get there. <laughs> yeah. person bike by bike you need all of your gear that you're going to be riding with everything that's on the checklist you'll need to be able to fire up your bike ride your bike prove that it stops along with a lot of other things so if you're not ready for that go get that come back and then we'll start hey what's up guys this is albert at ntx mini bikes outlaws pretty much open so just looking for uh loose parts air good air and tires and the brakes work in Checks out, everything's tight, brakes work, everything looks good, so she's ready to go. Yeah, making sure everybody runs safe, right? Oh yeah. We got our name, oh, we got name. Hey. We're at the Lime 100, Oklahoma, right outside of Ardmore. We're going to do a 100 lap enduro, about 38 miles. David Rogers, I'm from Arlington, Texas. I'm riding the Trailmaster MB200 pretty modified. It's a stage two, 62 sprocket. It's got Go Power Sports clear cover for the juggernaut with a larger size cover. It's got 22 millimeter carburetor. I'm running Kenda front tire. I'm running uh, Sun F. Okay. <laughs> I couldn't think of it. Yeah, the Sun F2 is on the back. And I, I, I saw they helped you out with the air filter earlier. Yeah, I guess I learned you can't put too much oil on your filter the day of the race 
yeah, yeah. made it cut out, so I had to switch filters. Other than that, she's running good now, ready for the race. Redneck Off-Road Haven in the Line 100. My name's Adam. I'm riding a mini Baja. Fixed up with everything from Go Power Sports like the Juggernaut clutch. Second, second converter cover. Yeah, it's got the Flying Tiger, the original Flying Tiger theme. Man, I love the military. It's a big supporter. And I went O3. It's got electric start, Bluetooth, high beams, low beams, tail lights. Thank you. You're welcome. Good luck on the race. Thank you. So we are at Lime 100 racing here on a almost sunny Saturday in Ardmore, Oklahoma. Loosely sponsored by Gambler 500, Lone Star Gambler 500, North Texas uh, Mini Bikes and North Tex Texas Rally Cross. Um, we had about 50 some riders registered. I don't know quite exactly how many we got uh, uh, checked in, but we're pretty close to that and we're about ready to start. And then we started racing. Tail outlaw and then soft tail outlaw. And the whole event, you know, it went pretty smooth. It was fun. What you doing way back here? I'm ready to get going. I go faster when I see right, something I gotta go. get. running up front for a while and then uh, came in a little too hot into a corner slid the rear end high sided and uh, broke broke the old collarbone but the bike you know it took it like a champ mm -hmm. we got to fix fix the trees like I said we've been playing around with different designs this will be lasered and formed piece really nice and heavy duty the bike performed arguably uh, flawlessly <laughs> <laughs> so the bike the bike performed flawless it um, was probably the fastest bike on the track I think and with not even a crazy engine it's just a stage 2 212 not a 225 or anything like that we got to heal up get better um, and then we're gonna test this thing more we got paint coming up and then uh, some more races Oh,